Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. My name is Anna Korowolo. I'm here with my family. I'm from River State, Ikure, precisely in Rupokwe here. Rupokwe here? Yes, sir. And people know you here? Yes. Uh -huh. uh, the, today is my first Sunday of coming here. But I've been here in Chukoko, not night. My testimony is three phases. The first one was when my wife came for mercy prayer. They were doing general mercy prayer. She told me, I said, please go, I don't believe in those things people are doing. And she followed the younger brother to this place. She did it. Then I have buildings all over within the Arupa Kodia. People were not living on it. People that will live before they will park at. When, then I, when agent bring people to live there, when they see the houses, they will run away, they will not come and pay. So after the mercy prayer my wife did, she now told me that she have to spray water. Said she, she fetched water from the house. The younger brother told her to bring water. She fetched water from the house. They blessed the water and the coconut she bought from home. And she went to that place and sprayed the water and prayed on that Saturday after the night vigil. She now, on, on Monday, I started receiving calls from agent. House, house, house. As I'm talking to you, those houses have been rented. Give Jesus a glove of free. <laughs> and you never believe on those things. You never believe on those things. But agents are calling you for house, 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 house. <laughs> uh -huh. Secondly, she has a school. And the issue was that there's a little problem. There was no school. People were leaving the school. A lot of problems. So a friend of mine said, I should call. He's going to be taking me to one church. We went to the place. When I got there, what I saw as a church, well, I stood there. The man of man not told me that uh, what you used to work for me is 600,000. Hey! Uh -huh. I told him I don't have money. He said I should go and look that. Whatever I have, I should do. I have to go and look around and get him 150,000. Then he now did something after all what he did. Nothing happened. I was having problem with my right leg. I told him that my leg is paining me seriously. He said, you give me medicine that will cure my leg. Eh. My brother, that day when I went there, I was with him. He said, let me go and get the medicine. As I was like, I sleep one, I went to do stuff. I saw something, OPM, the answer. OPM, the answer. I said, ah, what is all this? I woke up, this my head. I checked around if there's anything like OPM there. I didn't see. I ran out from the house. I didn't see anything like OPM samples. I realized again near my car. What I'm hearing is that leave here, go to OPM. You will get the answer of your problem. Hey. I came back. I told my wife, look at what I'm seeing. She said, yes, I told you, come. You will see what God will do there. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Give Jesus a glove of rain. But the first miracle that God made, the first miracle, God made tenants begin to come. As the first miracle, your wife came to open and did mercy prayer. Bam! The door opened. And he never wanted to come. You went to where? They said, bring 600,000. How much did you pay? 150,000. And there was no solution. The man saw your size. The man saw your size. Say, there's money here. <laughs> Say, bring 600,000. Uh -huh. So, on that place, after the, uh, the this thing, uh, uh, God started doing work in my family. And I told my wife, well, I'll follow you down to that night VG. I came to the, the night VG. No, before the night VG, in the school premises, my daughter, being this one here, a teacher sent her to go and collect something from the class. She came out from the class to collect something. Vulture came. She plated her hair. Vulture came on her hair to drag her hair up. So when the Vulture came, she now shouted, before the, their mother has put down bang, their opium bango on her hand. She now raised her hand up and shouted, Jesus. The Vulture left her and climbed, stand on top of the roof of the school. So when the vulture stood there, I was looking at her. The little the vulture fled away. I came back, she told me, I said, no, this is not ordinary. We must come to OPM church. I used the, my, I used scissors and cut off her hair immediately. Put it in a, 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 a cellophane bag. The mother brought OPM water and OPM sand with coconut and washed her head. 
say nothing will happen to her. On that last coconut night, we came here, I dropped those hairs and all those things, the virtual pest on the dustbin. I said, everything evil thing they have brought to her, I've returned back to the dustbin, it will not work. That was the prayer I did. Now, that night, this last night coconut we did here, mm. the long time no pay tight in church. My wife brought out 1,000 naira that she want to pay tight. I said, tight? Okay, I have 1,000, let me support your own. I gave her 1,000 to it's 2,000. She said she can't drop it. I said, no, she was saying that the man of the house, I should can't drop the tight. Uh -huh. I collected the tight. I came to this place. I prayed a prayer. I said, God, this is not a tight, but I'm sorry they see it for me to have something to pay a tight. Mm -hmm. uh, my tight will start from millions in this church. I praise God. I came back. No, no, the same prayer and praise what my wife is also praying there. When we finished the night VG on that day, this last look or not night, I went home. I ran that Saturday. I was sleeping, my phone rang. So, where are you there? Where are you there? I said, I'm in my house. I bet I want to see you, na 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 na. I said, anybody said they want to see her, she come. I went. They took me to one hotel. We we'll discuss finish. Hmm. The man said, I'm going to give you money now. I said, money? She doesn't say my account number. Like, how much? Is it 100,000? I said, no, so one. I said, one what? The man brought one million naira. Hey! If Jesus is a glass of rain, just with 1,000 naira, just 1,000. He saw the seed here. Say, God, this is not tight. It's a seed that will bring out money for tight. And look at it. As you got home that day, your phone rang. Yes, sir. Today, your phone will ring. <laughs> His phone rang. Say, come and meet me in the hotel. Bam! They discuss. Bam! One million. <laughs> uh -huh. He gave me that money, cash. Cash! cash. I said, uh, is it a setup? I go to him, I kept the money, nothing happened. They said that they were doing 13th, uh, 13th anniversary this last Sunday. Because I remember that night when we were praying that coconut milk. Daddy said something. Don't eat your tight. Pay your tight, your one tenth to the church. If you eat your tight, the other 90% will lose. I said, for me, not lost my money. I have to pay the tight. So I have to pay the tight by the grace of God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Give Jesus a glove of rain. Now, you believe that what we are doing here is real? Yes, I'm the one shouting the name everywhere on Abato PM. <laughs> that is it. That is the power of God of OPM. It reveals his power to his children. Now you have believed that God can do all these things. Yes, I do. But before, let them go. I don't believe. But now, you believe. Miram.